everyone, it's Adam Winnick and we are on Atlantic Avenue in Delray Beach, Florida. And today what we're gonna talk about is the single greatest financial investment that I ever made in my entire life. And I've made some really, really dumb investments in my life and I've also made some really smart ones. But in today's video, we're gonna talk about the greatest investment that I ever made. Um, so let me tell you a little bit about my investing history. I've made some really dumb, like stupid, stupid investments. Like one of them, for example, is this watch. Like I bought this originally um, because I thought it would make me look cool and I thought it would, you know, give me like status or whatever like that. And while it is a nice watch and what like whatnot, it, it hasn't made me a single dollar. So it's been a pretty poor investment as in terms of like return on your investment, right? Investing one dollar out in the the hopes of getting two dollars out hasn't really done that for me, okay? Just it's a watch, okay? Another investment that I made was into this car, right? Which I, I've invested in the cars before and I've never made a dollar on a car. I, I bought an Aston Martin, I lost tons of money on it, and this is an investment that I would consider a bad investment. I would actually consider this a liability, something that's taken money out of my pocket every single month. Um, now, I've also made dumb investments, investing into, um, I had, I invested into this hedge fund, a guy stole a bunch of money from me one time, I've uh, been ripped off, I've been scammed, um, I've invested in stuff that didn't really return me anything. I've also made some really, really smart investments. So, let me talk more about those because that would probably be more helpful to you. Um, one of the smartest investments that I have right now is my investment into my business, okay? Investing advertising into my business. For example, there's another video on my YouTube, I'll link it at the end. Um, and by the way, if you're liking this stuff, if you like this video and you're liking this channel so far, click below and click subscribe right now. Go hit it right now. Click the little bad investment. <laughs> click the little ding button, the little notification button, so you get notifications anytime we do it. Anyways, back to what I was talking about: um, investing into your business, which I think is the second greatest investment that you can make, at least for me. For example, we invest. Um, in the past six months, we've invested only about $26,000 into advertising, and that $26,000 has turned into $680,000 in revenue for our business. So if you're thinking, you might be thinking, that's a pretty damn good investment, right? A 2,500% return on your investment. I'm gonna show you an investment that's even better than that in just a second. But when you think about that, 26,000 into 680, that's a really, really good return on your investment. Now, if you look at some of the top investors in the world, guys like Warren Buffett, guys like Carl Icahn, they get about a 20% uh, percent to 31% return um, annually on their money. So every um, year they get about 20 to 30%. And obviously, I'm not dumb, right? They're playing with uh, 30, you know, they're playing with billions and billions and billions of dollars. I'm talking chump change compared to what they have. But even better than that, I think the best investment that I ever made, I wanna tell you a story, was when I was, I think I was 18 years old, and I was down in the dumps and started my first business and um, kind of got it rolling, and uh, this guy told me about this book. He said, you gotta buy this book. And um, at the time, like, I didn't really have, like, a whole lot of money. Like, I, I had literally just started my first little car detailing business where I was cleaning the neighbor's cars and whatnot like that. And he told me about this book that I have to get, and I actually have it in my back pocket right now. And so I remember, um, I remember that like that was a tough investment like taking something that wasn't gonna physically bring me any money in return but actually investing into myself and it actually turned out to be the best investment that I'd ever made in my entire life and here's what it is it was this book right here boom the secret a friend recommended it to me and he told me that I needed to buy this and um, at the time it didn't make any sense like why would I invest this into a book into information and from that point this book has led me down a whole different trajectory along my life where I've continued to make investments into myself. I'd say probably at this point in my life, realistically, I'd say I've invested maybe $200,000 into myself outside of my traditional education. You may be thinking, well, is it smart to actually invest into yourself or is it smarter to actually save? Like save money and put it away into you know an investment account or put it away for savings or something you want to buy. And my, my thing that the more that you can invest in yourself, the more you can invest into getting around people that are playing the game of life at a high level, into information courses, the better. And uh, I know for a fact for me, that's what's totally changed everything for me, was because the information that I took and the people I got around, I was able to learn, I was able to shortcut the way to success a lot faster. And the best investment that you can 
possibly ever make into yourself uh, in your life is continue to invest in yourself into your education because that's the only person the only thing that you can really bet on I mean when everything else has its ups and sounds you're always gonna be there and that's the best investment that you can make hands down so never stop investing in yourself